This is Buddy Cat. This is her first. I've actually pet him and he's purring. Sorry for the close-up of his nose, but I'm trying to pick up the sound of him purring. He's never purred when I petted him. Of course, he's laying here sleeping and happy. Probably dreaming of sunshine and tropical girls. That's Big Tom, I call him. He wants in the cat house with sunshine. Sunshine is not having it. He has took it over. So my two males are fighting over the cat house. And neither one was the intended recipient. I intended for Precious and her two babies to be in it. What's wrong, Tommy? You're cold and wanted in. And sunshine is not being very sunshine-like. And boy, do my cats make a mess on my window. And I gotta clean that today. You ain't giving up that house, are you, buddy? Sunshine says it is tough nookies, it is wet, cold. I warmed these leaves up, pressed them down, and you ain't getting in here. What's wrong, buddy? He going on. Didn't get a morsel of food, nor a place to stay. Sunshine says we got damn man up for that. Hello, YouTube. My package arrived, my new work bag. I got this one from Amazon. My other one came off eBay. They're the same brand, Nigel. Same design. Even though the writing is upside down, but the design is upside down this way. Open it up. And go from there. I'll set that there for the moment. Come, oh, good heavens. to get a hold of it. Tissue paper that is in the flap. Tissue paper in the other flap. I keep forgetting my trash can's there. I bought me a trash can. I usually stick my bag in my red wagon that I keep my yard decorations in. I decided to become mature after 40 years and get a trash can. And then it's got the little cell phone pocket. Back in the day, people had flip over cell phones. And they put them in a little pocket like that. This day and age, the way people steal, I wouldn't put an alligator in a pocket like that. And there's another little pocket. And the one with the little stethoscope design. My purse wants to take my sleeve. I need a little other end. 
Well, it's official. It made it. Get here. Mm -mm. My bag. A little bit bigger than my other one. Not quite as big as I thought it would be. But, put my umbrella in the bag. Maybe my boots in the bag. Umbrella. Things that I need. And it's smaller. My other bag was a little big to carry on the bus. So I think I'll carry this. My lunch bag. And I might have to, well, I'll keep my other purse too. But I think I might have to take my wallet out. Well, maybe not. Yeah, might have to take my wallet and transfer it between my regular purse and my work bag. But, you shall have a get ready with me in my new bag. I'm going to go cut my tag off and in this video. Well, I came up with a way to organize my bags to make room for me on the bus. And plus my other bags fell apart. I got my lunch bag in here and I kind of scrunched down. And my boots. I can't set it there because I got... It's fuzzy. Right there. Set that there. And I got my boots in my bag. Because snow hasn't hit yet. I won't be packing them. But when it does, I'll have them to put on my tennis shoes while I'm at work. And then when I go home, my boots back on. And I'll have my lunch bag. tried organizing it the other way, but the bag wasn't tall enough to hold my boots. So I had to make this kind of like a work bag and purse in one. And I got my little bag of essential grooming supplies, house keys, wallet, name tag. Pins, pocket change. I count them out in the dollar increments. Sunglasses, savings account. Krona mask umbrella. And my gloves. My umbrella wasn't long enough to fit in my purse there. I had to put it in this one. And then, like I said, my other bag wasn't tall enough. I mean, this bag wasn't tall enough for my boots. gate belt in there. My chapstick. And my hand sanitizer holder. Those I got off of Amazon. And I did an unboxing of them about a month ago. I 
haven't put anything in my other projects on here. But that's how I organize my bags. And I got my gloves and cleaner, more clean Corona mask. And my bandage scissors. I would like to get a holder and it has the stuff in it like uh, pole socks and all of that then I can carry all of that in my bag make things more compact These bags were a matching set, but this one's been washed and faded. I had it for a year or close to it now. And same way with the little one that I got inside my newer bag. But my other big bag, I pitched it out. It had a hole in it. And plus it was almost as wide as the bus aisles and I got towards the back seats. I had to scrunch it to, I mean like really scrunch it to get through the aisles. This, I can at least, you know, put them on my lap. Keep the one on my shoulder and have one on my lap if I have to. And I can fit through the aisles. Buttercup. Say hi to you, Tubies. That was it. Well, we got a unexpected packaging. I'm going to put it this way so people can't see the recipient. I mean, the person who sent it. It's from my boss, Ms. Lattimore. It's squishy down, so I'm thinking it's my company t-shirt. Yep, I'm right. Medium, dark purple. It's a polo collar. He's if you want to read it. I am definitely loving that. I will take photos of it. Ouch. And then I'll know what color of scrub pants and jacket to get. Dark purple. I have, I think, light purple, but no dark, I think. But I'm not sure.